Are you looking for a simple way to automate tasks? Then you can set up N8N with xCloud in just a few clicks. Let's get started. Start by logging into your xCloud account. Click on the New Site button from the dashboard. Then choose the server from the drop-down menu and click on the Next button. Now go to the One-Click Apps tab. Find and click on N8N to start the deployment process. Enter your site title and any helpful tags for this application. Then choose between the two deployment methods, Go Live for Production or Demo Site for Testing. If you pick Demo Site, xCloud assigns a temporary subdomain. Here we will set up the N8N application with a custom domain. Enter your custom domain and verify your DNS setup. Leave the port and site user as default. Then you can select your time zone for this site, then click Next to proceed. Once deployed, your N8N application will be ready to set up for automating your tasks. Click on Visit Site to access your new N8N instance. Complete the N8N account registration by entering your details. And you have successfully created an N8N account. Now you can click on the Create Workflow to start building automations from now on. From here, click on the plus icon to add the first step. Then search for Gmail and click on the On Message Received. A pop-up will appear and you will be asked to add your credentials. Choose Create New Credentials from the drop-down. Next, keep the OAuth 2 option and insert the Client ID and Client Secret keys. If you do not have the Client ID and Client Secret key, then click on the Open Docs to see the step-by-step -step process to collect both keys. Now click on the Sign In with Google button and complete the sign-in process. Once the process is done, you will see a successful message and the account will be connected. Now adjust the poll time and other configurations according to your preferences and click on the Fetch Test Event button. If Gmail is connected with NAN successfully, go back to your workflow canvas. From here, click on the plus icon to add the next step. Then search for Google Sheets and choose the Append or Update Now in the sheet as you did. Now connect your Google Sheets account using the same process we followed for Gmail. Once the process is completed, change the document source type to URL and paste the Google Sheet link where you want the emails. Next, change the sheet source type to URL as well and paste which Google Sheet that should keep the data. Next, go to the Mapping column mode and change it to Map Automatically option. Then click on the Execute Setup button. If the sheet is connected with N8N successfully, go back to your Workflow Canvas. Finally, click on the Execute Workflow button and save to complete the full setup process successfully. Next, activate the workflow to make it start working. Let's take a look at the automation we did in real time. Want to customize your N8N application? Let's go back to the xCloud dashboard again. Go to the Environment tab from the sidebar. Customize according to your preferences and click on the Update Environment when done. To use the latest N8N version, go to the Updates tab and check for the latest N8 version, then hit the Update button. Your application will run the latest version within a while. Now, let's configure your backup settings. Go to the Backup menu from the sidebar and choose Previous Backups. Click on the Add New Backup. It will take you to the Backup Settings option. Under Remote Backup, choose your preferred backup type. Then select the storage bucket. You can take any one backup from the database or files. Even exclude specific paths from the backup if needed. Next, you can set automated backup and set how often you want the backups to run for your application. You can also activate automatic delete. Once everything appears to be in order, click save. And you are all set to start backing up your site. Now, head over to the previous backup section and click on backup now to initiate a backup instantly. Once complete, your backup will show up here. And that is it. You have just deployed your N8N instance using xCloud in just a few clicks. If you found this helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tutorials. See you in the next one.